Hey everybody, this is Nikki from Christian Mommy Blogger, and I'm just uh, going to give you a quick overview of some basic settings in the SEO WordPress SEO by Yoast plugin. Um, this is my What is SEO post, which might have been the one that got you to start watching this series with me, uh, where I explain the overview of what is SEO and, um, and what I'm going to show you about how to start optimizing SEO, which is search engine optimization. I have installed my WordPress SEO by Yoast plugin, which gives me this area right here. This is SEO, there's a little gray button, and you can check your SEO. Now, we're going to try to get a green light. It will give us a green, a yellow, or a red light. Um, green means go, that you have your optimized settings in place and you're ready to maximize your post. A few key things to remember is this is your title of your post. You want this to be keyword rich. You want this to be something that that Google will see is is providing an answer for somebody else. That's the whole point. Somebody asks a question in search engine, Google answers it, and is your post going to be their answer? Then you have your post, you have your picture your image which you want to have an alternative description which is which should be the same keyword rich as your title that's maximizing it you have your content you want your content to naturally have as keywords in it net naturally be SEO rich which is gonna have the same keywords that you have in here what is SEO how to start optimizing SEO. So in there, my keyword is what is SEO? SEO is my keyword. How to start optimizing. Somebody might plug into a search engine. I want to start optimizing SEO. Well, if my keyword is start optimizing SEO, Google knows that. So I don't have to tell Google every time that that's my keyword. They know that because of the frequency of it appearing in the title, in my image, in my content and in my my headers h2 which is header 2 and h3 which is heading 3 h2 is just the HTML call for that those are those are loved by Google that allows the spiders that crawl all over to easily see it so I make sure to put my keyword in the title or from the title into H2 or H3. So I have here, what is SEO? So I have my content where I'm chatting with you guys, where you get to know me, where I'm personable and where I'm explaining my content. And then I have my keywords. This does not mean you bold it and you make it bigger. It literally means you use the H2 tag, which through your visual editor is it heading two and through your text editor is H2 and you close your tags with that. So we have what is SEO? I have what I explain as SEO, my content. And then I have another H2, how to optimize your site for SEO. Now here, you're, I, I actually have done this on purpose. <laughs> how to optimize your site for SEO, how to start optimizing SEO. Those are things that actually will give you a not a green light. So we're going to correct those. I used how to start optimizing your site for SEO and then my, my points that I'm going to be covering, I put in H3. So they come out a little bit smaller on my posts, but they're still flags to, to the Google spiders that are crawling. And um, we'll be going over those later. And we're going to keep going down here. Once you install the plugin, you're going to go down past your post, past your layout settings, to this little area down here where it says WordPress SEO by Yoast. You're going to stay in this general tab. Your snippet preview shows you on a Google web page what your post will look like. You know what this looks like if you went to Google right now and just said, what is SEO? Or any other search term you're looking for, you would see a, res a result that was the title, 
the website it came from, the actual URL, and a brief description. This is called the meta description. Now, what you should do each and every time you go into a post and after you write it, I, I would recommend writing it. Do your best to find your own keywords and figure out what you want to repeat. Then come down here and enter your focus keyword. And I want mine to be, I could do SEO. That is going to tell me an SEO title. This will replace this snippet preview. So I don't replace that. I never type this in here. I want it to just match what I already have up at the top. Now, your meta description. What is SEO? How a guide to Now, you can see that it gives me 18. This shows you how many times your keyword appears. Article heading, page title, page URL, content, meta description. It does not show you about your alt description in your picture, so you just want to make sure that you do that. And I'll have a plugin for you to use for that, which will automatically work for you. Now, if I save draft, watch this light. Gives me a green light. That means this is SEO optimized and ready to go. Now, I will say that I'm going to, for this post, say what is SEO. And you can use Yoast, this plugin. The reason I like it is because maybe Mo that, that shows that people are actually literally Googling what is SEO. This is already established as a focus keyword. So I'm going to pick this because then it narrows in even more on, um, let's save draft. Now my content count for the word, the keyword will go down. However, see now it's only one, 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 one. But the thing is, is that that's more focused for this post, which means if somebody literally types in what is SEO, and my only keyword was SEO, I might not come up as high. But it's really common to say, what is SEO? And I want to just rank higher. So I, I focused in even more. Now I could go through and add, and add this. Let's see. Um... I could go through, so I have it right here, what is SEO? I could go through my post and up here in my intro, right? Um, I get a lot of questions asking me, what is SEO? I could add that in there and then that would increase this content to two and uh, could perhaps boost me a little bit higher in the SEO, in the Google search results. But for now, I just wanna make sure that it appears but I update my alt description and now I'm ready with the green light to go um, and to change your description um, alternative text right here I'll change this to what is SEO and I'll update so now I am good to go SEO optimized using the WordPress by SEO I'm sorry, WordPress SEO by Yoast plugin. And um, make sure to continue watching the, or following the SEO, how to start optimizing SEO series I'm doing here by Christian Mommy Blogger, where you will learn all of the aspects um, for how to optimize your site. Thanks guys, have a great day.